is going on today guys we are near boundary peak and we're gonna hike it today this is the tallest peak in nevada there's the top of the mountain up there Alrighty guys, so I think we're maybe like a quarter or the third of the way up, but we've already lost the trail. We're just kind of heading up this ravine. But that was one of the things that said that it's really easy to lose the trail. So when you see this sign, make a right and not a left. If you come here, make sure you have all your maps and everything ready because there's seriously no service right now. And uh, we're just kind of winging it up the side of this mountain. Alrighty guys, so I think this hike is gonna be a fail for today. We got off trail and we started hiking up the left side of this ravine. And uh, and I could see the trail is down that way. I went up the wrong way, but uh, sorry about that. So at least if you're watching this video, at least you'll have a good idea of what this area is like and uh, you won't get- Boundary Peak lays unconquered. Some cool pieces of city. Completely see through. Alrighty guys, so we took the wrong turn. There's the car way over there. And uh, we couldn't find the mine, so we, but we saw- We missed the fork in the road. <laughs> it's a nail. <laughs> we nailed it. <laughs> oh my God. Dad jokes. And then we got this old uh, building there, probably from the 1800s. Uh, water tower here. And then we got this car over here. Oh, it looks like it was some kind of kiln. A kill? Oh, like maybe afterwards, someone was using it as a fire. Look, there's like jeans in there. Someone's jeans are in there. Charred remains. Char some charred remains. Charred. Look, there's a tennis shoe. Some charred remains. Some just inferno to body. What is that? Looks like some kind of cement or something. So we found this, uh, looks like some kind of, like a Sears catalog, but it says like December 1967. That's been sitting there. Crazy. Looks like we got some old, uh, bed springs or cots here. Old uh, stove. Does that have the year on it? Oh, it just says 18. Modern main bottom. A bunch of other old metal. Scrap metal everywhere. Another mattress spring. Oh, yeah. Bones everywhere. So we walked to the end of this little area. We're like right on the edge of this canyon, but I don't know if you can see it, but all these cans are just thrown on the side of this hill here. 
Like that's where they just, how, that's how they got rid of all their trash. Anybody know what kind of car this is? If you know what kind of car this is, leave it, leave it in the comments. Looks like an American Motors Rambo. Quit making noise back in the sixties. So there's a serial number right here. What's it say? It's just a serial number. Oh. Dang. All right, so check it out, guys. This is what a homestead would have been like around the late 1800s. See how the roof's caved in. So back on the other side, this was, I guess, maybe some kind of gate. There's a lot of barbed wire here. Looks look like some kind of hinges. And I guess maybe a part of a gate. Yeah, it was a gate, it's a gate or something. Check out these windows. Big pieces of timber there. That's cool. <sighs> cool. Hey guys, thanks for watching my little adventure. I just want to give an extra thanks to everyone for taking the time out of their day to watch these little adventures. It really means a lot to me and it makes these adventures a lot more worthwhile. Not all adventures go perfectly, but I always try to do my best to at least show you guys something interesting. So I just want to give an extra big thank you to all my subscribers. It's good to reach out to people with like-minded interests because sometimes it gets kind of lonely out here. So I hope you liked this adventure, even though it didn't go as planned. If you did, please hit that like button. And if you're new here, please consider hitting that subscribe button. I'd love to have you come along on more of my future adventures. Thanks guys, and I'll see you out there. Make this promise on this channel. Before I ever quit this channel, I'm gonna hike the tallest peak in every state starting next year with Boundary Peak.